Good morning, everyone. Happy Monday. It's a new week. I like last Monday better than this Monday because it was a holiday, but here we are. But it's exciting week. So last week, Mason had his preseason games. This week, which starting tomorrow, tomorrow's game day, is actual season. So game one, official game one. Eeks, I'm excited. So that's what we have to look forward to. He has two games this week. I think pretty much every week he'll have about two games. There might be a week that he has like three games. So I don't know, lots of baseball coming your way. We also ordered a new camera in our last vlog. I talked about that. That should be arriving hopefully this week. I think we'll have one more game without the new camera. So that stinks. Sorry about that guys. Stay patient, I know it's blurry and out of focus a lot of times when we're filming with our baseball camera, so we're working on it, it's on its way. But anyways, it's Monday. Let's get our day started. It's gonna be a good week. Happy Tuesday, everyone. It's here, season opener, game one of Mason's senior season. He's about ready to head out. How you feeling? You ready? Yep. Let's get his water, the usual. So yeah, he'll head up, and then Jack and I will meet him at the fields in a little bit, but it it is here. The hype is real. I can see all the, like I think pretty much all the schools in the area, today's day one of season, so um, here we go. I'm excited for him. Go kill it this year. Opening day. Opening day. <laughs> I like it. Ace telling you good luck. I suppose so. So what do we tell what do we tell Mason Ace? Good luck. Good luck. Have fun. Have fun. And play ball. Do your best. Oh. <laughs> Somebody said I should get um shirts made up because how many times do you guys think I've said that phrase to Mason every time he goes to play a baseball game? Good luck, have fun, do your best. Alright, Mace, love you kid. Drive safe. We'll see you at the field. Appreciate it. What about Ace? Is he playing today? Union so or? we've decided Ace gets like this when he sees this. The uni. The uni oh, because dad. he knows his brother's leaving and then mom and dad probably leave soon after. <laughs> Are you snoring? Oh, look at this side eye. Oh, he's so sad. Don't be sad, buddy. We'll come back. <laughs> We're on him. Got him. Here we go. There, get there, get there. Oh, baby. Here we go. Here we go. Here we go. Good job, Mason. Look at him. Look at him. Look at him. Good job, Jake. Ooh, good idea. Good. Throw. Beat it, beat it, beat it, beat it. Here we go. 30 feet before the back. It's like, no, dude. Quick, quick, quick. Woo! Oh, my God. Stay down. Hey boy, Owen. Hi, fellas. Oh, 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 oh. Oh, there you go, bud. Oh, there you go, bud. Boy. Oh, but we were right around where you were. Correct. Oh, oh. Gotta go, never know. Gotta go, Jake. Gotta go. Come back, come back. Let's go, Cal! 
Good job. Good job. Good job. Good afternoon, everyone. It is Wednesday, which means we are halfway to the weekend. Um, so this morning started out fun. I come downstairs talking to Jack on the phone because this is so cute, you guys. He calls me every day on his way into work, just something he's always done. So I'm on the phone with Jack, and then all of a sudden my other line goes beep, beep, beep. I'm like, who's calling me this early? And it's Mason. And I'm like, what the heck? I knew he was up getting ready for school, and he calls me, and I'm like, why does he just come down and talk to me? What is he doing? He's on the phone. He's like, Mom, there's a scorpion in my bathroom, in my shower. And I'm like, no, why? You guys, I love the desert. I talk about it all the time. Love living in Arizona, but that's the one thing that I hate is the scorpion. And it's only February. Why are they coming out to play already? It's too soon. <sighs> but we have gotten into like the 80s the last couple days, so I guess this guy said, hey, I'm coming in. And the best part about that story is I go, so I'm like, Jack, there's a scorpion. He's like, all right, go get the bug spray, get a shoe, do all the things that we normally do to get the scorpions out of the house, kill them. I don't like, take them out of the house, I kill them. I know some of you might be upset about that, but there's enough scorpions. That one's not gonna live another minute of its life. So I go upstairs, I absolutely hate it. In fact, there's one time Mason was at practice, Jack was driving home, and there was a scorpion hanging from our light fixture up there on the fan, and I sat there and stared at it until Jack got home to kill it. So I do not do well with the scorpions. So Mason, bless his heart, I go upstairs with the shoe, the scorpion spray, Clorox wipes, all the things. Should have grabbed the camera because I know some of you probably would have liked to see the scorpion in the house. And I'm like screaming and Mason's like, seriously. And I'm still on the phone with Jack. He's like, what is wrong, mom? Give me the shoe. And he just, you know, swats the thing. And um, yeah, Mr. Scorpion is long gone. So that's how we started off our Wednesday morning. Fun story. Oh, and then the story even gets better. Guess who's knocking on the door shortly after that? the pest guy, because we get our house sprayed regularly. Um, but unfortunately, scorpions, like your regular pest control doesn't take care of scorpions. You have to do extra steps to get rid of scorpions. Um, they always, around this time, will say, hey, do you guys wanna do all the extra steps? We typically get maybe, I think last summer, maybe two, maybe three scorpions in our house the entire year, so I don't know if it's worth all the money. Um, but I always tell Jack, if there's more than that, we're gonna take steps to get rid of all the scorpions. So I don't know what they do. I think they spray like your base around your entire house um, and check for like, cause they can literally squeeze in like the smallest, smallest cracks. So yeah, scorpions are definitely a thing that we deal with here in Arizona. Rattlesnakes, coyotes, all the things. But it is beautiful to live here. In fact, last night Mason's game was absolutely gorgeous. My parents ended up coming to the game, so it was good to see them. It did get a little bit chilly towards the end once the sun sets, but it's the desert. That's what we do here. It does get cold at night. But anywho, that's my fun story for our Wednesday. Good times. <clears throat> Mason was home for just a little bit. He's already back at school for practice, so no game tonight. I think our next game is gonna be Friday, so he'll probably have practice today and tomorrow. And I'm just waiting for Jack to get home because my Wednesday's gonna get even better. It's tax day. We have our appointment to file our taxes, so that's what we got going on. So I'm just waiting for Jack to get home and then we'll be off to do file our taxes. Good times. You guys, my head hurts again. But we're done. Taxes are done for 2023. Got that done and over with, so that feels amazing. Cause now I don't have to stress about it anymore. Jack, how's your head? <laughs> Mush. Hurting. Um, we came home, um, we were there a little bit longer than I thought we were gonna be there. So this guy is super hungry and I was thinking Mason would eventually get home from practice, but he's still not home from practice. So he couldn't feed the dog either. So sorry Ace. But speaking of dinner, I gotta figure out what we're gonna do for dinner. I'm gonna figure out if Mason's gonna come home for dinner, all the things. But the best part about today, not the scorpion you guys, but our taxes <laughs> are done. <laughs> <laughs> taxes are done, yay! We adulted today. I'm yes. done with adulting. <laughs> well, Mason decided to go out to dinner with some teammates. 
So then Jack and I were like, all right, let's go out. And then I was like, I don't feel like going out. Like nothing sounds good, like fast food. I'm like, I have something fast to make in my own freezer. So orange chicken from Trader Joe's for the win. I'm ready to make up our little bowl. So like, why would we go to Panda Express or anywhere like that when I can do it right here in my own kitchen and it's yummy. Um, highly recommend if you guys have not tried the um, orange chicken from Trader Joe's. We put it in the air fryer and get it nice and crispy as you just saw. It's really yummy. Normally I do vegetables on the side for Mason and I, but since it's just me and Jack, I'm like, I'm not even really hungry. I told Jack, I think just the, the adulting just took the appetite right out of me. <laughs> Happy Thursday, everyone. I feel like this has been the longest week ever, but here we are, it's Thursday. It's Friday Eve, which feels so good. I'm ready for the weekend. It's been a long week. But with that being said, I um, was exercising on the bike today and I'm like, what can I make for dinner? Because Mason has practice, no game tonight, so I can make a good dinner. Last night, you guys saw what we did after we did our taxes, just a quick little dinner. I wanna make something yummy, something I haven't done in a while. And I don't know why, but I was like, chicken cutlets. I have not done chicken cutlets in forever. And I have some like protein pasta and a sauce that I got. I'll show you guys maybe later when I start cooking dinner that I got from Trader Joe's that I've been wanting to use. So I think chicken cutlets, with a side of pasta, and maybe some broccoli. Sounds good, something different. Haven't done that in a while. So I'm about ready to head out to the grocery store to get some chicken because I definitely do not have chicken. I need to like do a restock of groceries. Plus the store that I'm going to has really, they normally do, hopefully they do. They have really, really thin chicken breasts, so that makes the best chicken cutlets. So I'm headed off to do that, and then I just wanna sit on the couch. I feel like I've been go, 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 I'm tired. I either need a coffee, energy drink, something to <laughs> get me through the rest of this day. They had my chicken, I'm back from the grocery store. Um, so this is what I ended up getting. Chicken, eggs, cookies for Jack, cheese, and thankfully I looked at the last second, my breadcrumbs were um, expired by a couple months, so I needed new breadcrumbs. $22. Not bad, especially because I got this brand cheese, but this was on sale for $1.97. So $1.97, $1.97, $1.97. And these were on sale for $2.97. Everything else was not on sale. <laughs> so I got the cheapest eggs, just plain old, cage-free large eggs those were eggs thankfully have gone down a little bit but they're still kind of pricey to me what were the eggs 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 349 349 for eggs and the chicken was probably the most expensive at 709 <laughs> can you see it they do it so thin at the the butcher there so that's why I went there but, all right there you go that's my little grocery haul. So dinner tonight and a couple of things to get us through. But you guys, I'm about ready to make my chicken cutlets. Um, Mason hopefully will be home. Hopefully I'm timing this right. He'll be home from baseball and then he'll have dinner waiting for him. But this is what I said I was gonna show you. Got this sauce around Valentine's um, at Trader Joe's. Never had it, so we're gonna give it a try. We're gonna talk. Love this stuff. Made from chickpeas. So good. Tastes like noodles. Like you have no idea that you're getting like extra protein and fiber and all the good stuff. So in your pasta. Highly recommend that. But um, all right. Wish me luck. Here we go. Here you go. Time to eat. Mason is home from practice to eating dinner. How is it? I didn't try the chicken. You haven't had the chicken yet? Awesome. Jack, how was the chicken? Oh, he's editing, he's got his, he can't hear me, he has his headphones on. Um, I will speak for Jack though, he said it was amazing. He had two big old cutlets and is very full now, but he said it was really good. So, dinner was amazing. Um, like I just said, Jack's editing, and you're like, why is he editing, it's only Thursday. Mason has a baseball game tomorrow night. On that note, I'm gonna go ahead and end this vlog because we'll be home late tomorrow night and no time to edit or upload videos. So we're gonna do it today. So that's ready for you guys Saturday morning. So on that note, don't forget to like this video, comment something in the comment section, subscribe. As always, thanks for watching. We will see you next time.